What's up today, my wonderful family? I'm actually sitting right outside of uh, my P.O. box. And I just finished reading a very, very encouraging piece of mail that I got. Uh, they pretty much wrote me a letter on the inside. And uh, first of all, I'm here to say thank you. Second of all, I'm here to address the three questions that they listed at the very bottom of the card. And the questions were, do you recommend that I start a YouTube channel? If so, what type of camera do I need to start? And number three, what type of lighting setup do I need? Like, what type of lights do I need to buy, okay? And I'm making this video... For this individual and for anyone else out there who has the same questions you may you may have felt like uh you know the law was putting youtube on your heart and you wanted to make a video but you just could never really get started right you just never had the confidence to put your first video out there so i'm here today to help you and answer those questions okay first of all i want to say pray about it right if the Lord gives you an overwhelming peace about it, you should definitely step out on faith, right? Don't despise small beginnings. Many people don't get started because they say, man, I see all these videos on YouTube getting a million views and my video only got three views in, in, in two weeks. All right. Don't worry about the views. You see, you worrying about the wrong thing. You already getting distracted. OK, many people say, man, if only three people going to watch, I ain't, I, ain't, I ain't wasting my why, why even waste my time, man. That's only three people. I ain't wasting my time, man. Listen, you, that means your heart was never in it in the first place, right? Jesus ministered, ministered to the woman at the well. That was one-on-one -on -one ministry. Jesus took time to one-on-one, -on -one, right? So who are you to think that you're too big for one view, right? Listen, if you only get one subscriber, if only one person watches your channel, listen, that's more than enough. Drill them with content. Love on them. Help them. Uh, spread God's word. Whenever they comment saying, hey, I needed this. I'm having a rough day. Comment below and say, look, let's talk about it. What's up? How was your day? What's what's making your day wrong? Maybe I can help. They may comment back and say, I ate a snowball and my spoon broke. And then you can write back and say, you know what? I had that same problem, but let me tell you what I did. That spoon that broke inside of my snowball, I took that spoon out. I went back to the snowball stand and I got another one, right? So you can help people out with their little current day issues, okay? But anyway, let's get back to the video. So listen, I'm here to give you three points that, that will help you out, all right? Listen, do what you can, start where you are, and use what you have, okay? Do what you can, start where you are, and use what you have. Before I get into that, let me talk about something else. Listen, don't worry about getting the most expensive camera. Don't worry about the lights. Don't worry about any of that, right? Just use any, just use what, well, I'm going to get to use what you have. Let's see, do what you can, use what you have, and start with you. I'm going to get to that. That's point number two. I'm all over the place. Sorry about that. But anyway, let's get back to the video. Number one, do what you can. <laughs> do what you can. Listen, do what you can. Many people will say, man, listen, I work three jobs. I really just ain't got time. Well, listen, I'm here today to tell you that if it's important to you, you will always find a way. If that woman is really on your heart, if that's really the the woman right that you value you'll make time to maybe take her out once every now and then i'm not sure you may have not taken her out in three years but listen if, if it's important to you you will make time take the woman out i'm not saying you got to spend five hundred dollars take her out to mcdonald's all right you know what i mean just listen do what you can you may say man i only got five dollars i can't take i can't take her out or you may be a woman you may say you know what i, I want to take him out. i don't want to show him my appreciation but i don't have any money all i got is 50 cents Hey, man, all you got to do is take them to the dollar store right next to the cash register. They got some little blow pops, you know, two for 10 cent. Get them blow pops. Y'all go to the park. Y'all walk around and chew on the blow pops, you know, get get him a strawberry and you get the raspberry. Man, come on now. That's what more could you ask for? You get to eat the candy and then in the middle of blow pop, you get gum. So that'll, that'll last some two or three hours. So, you know, y'all have a good time and y'all get to talk and walk around, the, you know, the little pond or whatever. You know how it is in that park right by your house, all right? But anyway, let's get back to the video. Sorry if I get sidetracked. Listen, so do what you can. Make time for what's important to you, okay? If you really love people, if you really want to spread God's word, make time. Make this a priority. Schedule time to make your videos. Next point, uh, wait, do what you can. Start where you are and use what you have. That's right. Uh, do what you can. Start where you are. Okay, we're going to start where you are. Listen, start where you are. Listen, you will never get to where you want to go if you don't start where you're at right now. In other words, if I want to run to that gas station over there, instead of me just focusing on the gas station and, and, and how good it looks inside, I need to focus on right now. I need to focus on putting my left foot in front of my right foot and walking. Listen, the journey of a thousand miles must begin with a single step. Okay? Start where you are. 
Don't worry about that HD camera. You use your, your little raggedy cell phone you got, that the, the little blurry pictures. You know, you take the selfies, you could barely, people could barely make out who you are. I understand. I know how your phone is. But listen, use that. So what is not the best lighting? Use that to create your first video. That will then create momentum, okay? What you want to do is create momentum. Start off with posting once a month. When you've been faithful with that and you consistently did that, then go to two, then go to two a month, then three a month. Then you may say, well, you know what? I want to do two a week. Then go to three a week. Then you may move to five a week. Then you may go to every single day videos, okay? Start where you are. You Do, do your first video and create momentum. All right, and the last, the last thing I want to talk about, do what you can, start where you are. Use what you have. You may say, man, listen, I'm going to be honest with you. I want to spread God's word, but I don't really know them scriptures like that. I'm going to be honest with you, man. I don't really read my Bible. All I know is one scripture. Hey, guess what? Use that one scripture. Use what you have. You may say, man, listen, all I know is John 3, 16. I got it tattooed right here. You want to see it? Nah, I don't want to see your tattoo, man. I believe you. I believe it's on you. But use that scripture. Make every single video you do about John 3.16. Drill them with John 3.16. Make it to where they hear John 3.16 and they sleep. Use what you have. Right? Do what you can. Start where you are. Use what you have. You may say, man, listen, I've been divorced six times. I got 20 children. And man, I got stomach aches. Hey, that's your testimony. Use what you have. Give that to them. Somebody else out there has a stomach ache. They didn't know how you got through it. Somebody else out there been divorced. They want to know how you got through it. Use what you have. Listen, your testimony is the key that can unlock someone, someone else's prison. Okay? Your testimony is the key that can unlock someone else's prison. Right? Don't be ashamed to, to, to speak God's word. Don't be ashamed to come out here and help people. All right? So I challenge you. Listen, pray about it. If God gives you a peace, step out on faith and post your first video. All right? Just focus on one view, all right? Just focus on one view. Don't worry about 10. You'll get there one day. But for right now, you just focus on one person, all right? Be faithful with a few, all right? I love you. Listen, I hope these quick tips helped you out. Be sure to subscribe for more videos like this. I'm always here for you. I love you. I'll talk to you in the very next video.